Welcome to Cabin Kids Online. I'm Matthew. I'm Lilia. I'm Iris. I'm Lily. And I'm Lila. And today we're doing the Power versus No Power Challenge. So basically, we're going to be in, te in teams of two. It's Lilia and Matthew versus Iris and Lily. And I'll be the host. So basically, I have this battery here. And I'm going to put it in one hand. And then one of the teams is going to have to pick which hand they want. If they get the one with the battery in it, they get a power tool to assist them in the challenge. If they get the one that's empty, then they don't get a power tool to assist them in the challenge. All right, guys, it's time for our first challenge. And first to complete it wins. This one is a math challenge. So I'm gonna mix up this battery. Okay, so it's in one of my hands. And uh, I'm gonna let Matthew and Lilia go first because they're on my right side and I'm right handed. <laughs> All right, so which one is it in? Which one do you get? This one? Let's see your last pick. Yes? All right, it has a battery. So oh, they get to use. Um, the phone for this math challenge. So, we're good at math. Right? Okay. <laughs> sure. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go! Okay. Okay. Oh, wait, it's not. Oh, wait, it's not. So, it's the other one. Four, two, eight. 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 Who's gonna finish first? Ooh, that's on the wall. Wait, are you supposed to go zero and then that's supposed to be the five right there? So, honey? Because that's in the middle. Zero. Oh, okay. Yeah, minus 17. Mm -mm. All right, they're done. Are you guys gonna check it again? Yeah. Okay. When you guys are done, then and then the yeah. your final answer was in front of me. Matthew and Lilia finished first. All right, you guys have to stop. Okay, finish first. As you can see, Lilia and Matthew won, and Iris and Lily, they weren't even close. Honestly, that's just, no. <laughs> so, it's time for challenge number two. So basically, each team has three screws, and they have to screw all of them into the wood. So I'm gonna mix up the battery to see who gets the power or what? Yeah, yeah, who gets the power? Okay. Um, we're gonna go like the room. Yeah. That one? The other one? Nope. Oh, no. No. Oh, nice. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So here you go. In three, two, one, go. I'm gonna push like really hard. Oh, you're supposed to hold it down. Don't drill into the table. It's not even going. Here, come on, you got this. Twist it. Put some muscle into it, guys. Muscle, muscle, muscle. Do you have to go all the way in? Go in. There. All right. This. They won again. Oh, yeah, oh, they won oh, again. Oh, and they. They were. They're like halfway. Half one. Halfway. Yeah. Got, we got one in. Okay. At first, it like wasn't even going in. Alright. So it's time for our next challenge. It's time for the third challenge. This is a Bible challenge. So it's going to be one team is going to have the Bible and then the other one is going to have uh, the Bible app. So I'm going to mix up the battery. I really hope we did. I 
Susan, Pastor. Come on, come on, Aaron. This one? No, no, it's not here. Yeah. Is it this one? Okay, fine. So you guys, they get that. Uh, you guys get this. And the Bible verse you're looking up is Isaiah 53, 5. Three, two, one, go. Isaiah 53, 5. Wait, what? Isaiah 53, 5. Where's the sand? You look like you got it. Okay. We got it. Really got it. Right there. All right. I actually thought they would win, but they were looking for it. like open up the Bible. They were looking for the Bible app. She didn't even put it on the Bible I know. For the last challenge, um, we're going to go one team at a time, and they're going to enter into a dark room. There's four pieces of candy in it, and they're going to have to find two of them. So the power one is they're gonna have a flashlight and the non-power, they're not gonna have anything to help them. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna... Okay, I've got it. This one? Nope. Oh. So they get the power and they don't. All right, All right so we got they're, this. They're gonna go first. All right. Definitely way easier. Well, I don't know about the Bible. I think it's way easier to actually open up the Bible. Yeah, than like searching through all the verses. Just like the power tools help them with the challenges, the Holy Spirit's power can help us to do what God's called us to do. The Bible says in Acts 1-8, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. The Holy Spirit gives us the power to pray and spread the good news. He also does miracles through us and helps us to follow God. We can't do these things without His power in us. If you want His power, all you have to do is ask. So let's pray. Father God, I just thank you for this wonderful day. I pray that you will empower us to do things that we can't even imagine us doing. That you will, that your Holy Spirit will just come on us and that you will help us to minister to others so that your Holy Spirit can be on them as well. In the name I pray, amen. 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 Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and watch our Facebook Live every Sunday morning. Bye! Bye.